Fortnite Mares this year has to be one of the best Fortnite Mares events we have ever gotten here in Fortnite, and we have a ton of new secret updates to go over, new skin release dates, like for Leatherface, and also a bunch of secrets coming through, news on the brand new season, news on new collabs coming through, and also new Disney announcements. If you're excited to check this out, make sure you stay tuned and watch this video until the end. And also, really quickly, if you want a chance of getting yourself a gifted item like here on screen, all you gotta do is drop a like subscribe and turn on those notifications most importantly leave your epic games account name down below up in the comments so i can add you up and gift you if you end up winning good luck now with that being said we have the official release date for leatherface and as y'all could see leatherface is officially being released in the fortnite item shop on october 25th leatherface just the skin is going to be 1500 V-Bucks, the Chainsaw Pickaxe is going to be 1200 V-Bucks, and also the Chainsaw Pickaxe includes an emote as well. So it's included with the pickaxe. Pretty dope. The full bundle, if you go with the full bundle, it's going to be 2500 V-Bucks, so be prepared. It's officially dropping on October 25th. Now, a friendly reminder, if you're planning on copping yourself that or anything from the Fortnite Battle Royale item shop, consider using code OO7. I am an epic partner, so if you do take two seconds out of your day to support me, thank you so much. Hashtag ad. Now, with that being said, we have a ton of new updates to go over for Fortnite Mares, new secrets, and much more. First things first, Fortnite is currently working on a new shoes cosmetic. They will be sold in the item shop separately or in bundles. So this is pretty interesting. I assume this is how it's going to work. Any Fortnite skin you're using, you can go ahead and throw on the shoes you want on. Whether those are Nikes, Adidas, whatever it is, the shoes you'll be able to purchase separately and put it on whatever skin you want. Now, I assume this is going to be anywhere from like 300 to 500 V-Bucks for the pairs of shoes within the Fortnite item shop, and then maybe up to like 800 V-Bucks, depending on what pair of shoes we got. So that's pretty interesting. Eventually, I assume Fortnite's going to do shoes, obviously, t-shirts, pants, hats, glasses, and more. So I think they're going to continue adding custom items to the Fortnite item shop. Individual items, I should say. Now, with that being said, we have some breaking news. Fortnite and Disney will be making new announcements for the up-and-coming event. So, DC23 in Brazil is taking place on November 9th. Now, during this event, there should be some official announcements from Epic Games, from Fortnite, and from Disney. Some announcements that are going to be taking place most likely in Fortnite, new collaborations, etc. So be prepared for that. That's definitely going to be super exciting. We have some news on the newest Sabrina skin. So as you know, the Espresso emote was removed from the item shop after being released. Well, we have an update directly from Fortnite. The Espresso emote will be added back to the item shop soon. Anyone who purchased the caffeinated emote prior to its adjustment will be able to return it without spending a refund ticket if they prefer. Now, if you already have the emote, it's going to be the same thing. You don't have to do anything, but when you play the emote, you're going to notice it's the regular song, not sped up. So be prepared. It's coming back soon. Now, speaking of emotes and music, we have some brand new jam tracks coming through. We have four new jam tracks dropping this Thursday. Be prepared. Of course, we have that dropping on Thursday, and then we have a leather face coming out the following day. A lot of exciting stuff taking place. And now, something else that was recently announced, kind of like a teaser, is this. They basically teased Lego Deadpool in the new Lego Marvel Avengers. So it showed a Deadpool Lego model in Fortnite. So I assume this means... Very soon, we should be seeing a LEGO version variant of Deadpool within Fortnite here pretty soon. So just keep that in mind. Could be, or maybe not. But most likely, we'll see a Deadpool variant for LEGO very, very soon. Now, we have new updates coming through to Fortnite. Of course, the brand new season's brewing up soon. And then we have a brand new chapter coming through. But Fortnite is currently working on a new game mode. The up-and-coming Fortnite game mode that's set to release later this year will include its own ranked mode. 
Remember, this mode will be created heavily using UEFN. So this is going to be very interesting. It's either going to be another version of Battle Royale, or it's going to be like a completely new mode that no one's expecting. Nonetheless, once this is officially out, I'll keep y'all in the loop. Now, speaking of new seasons and new chapters, Fortnite Remix Chapter 2 OG is coming through soon. We're going to be seeing some new Remix skins. So Midas, Mascal Remixes are coming through. TNT, Tina Remixes are coming. The Sharks are returning. Boogie Bombs are returning. And the Butterfly will be involved in some way in Chapter 2 OG. So there's a lot of exciting stuff coming through. Remember, the new season is about a week and a bit away. So I'm sure we'll be seeing more teasers leading up to the main release. Be prepared. Now, the last update of Season 4 is now confirmed. It's basically going to be next Tuesday. So be prepared because this update is going to include some live in-game event information, new collab information, battle pass skins for the next season, and much more. So a lot of exciting stuff brewing up. Something else brewing up is Porsche X Fortnite. The collaboration is coming soon. Porsche is coming to Fortnite very, very soon. Be ready because this collab, we're definitely going to have to see the 911, you know, within the Fortnite item shop. And then eventually the Porsche GT3 RS will definitely be released too, I assume, eventually. So super exciting stuff coming through. New car collaborations are brewing up. Now, with that being said, a reminder that there's a ton of rewards that you can unlock right now, including all four level up pack quests are now available or now out. So you can get yourself the total of 28 levels plus all the rewards. Also, you can get nine of the 11 free rewards for four nightmares, which are super lit. More on that here soon. And then all the weekly quests are out plus the quest rewards. Keep that in mind. Also, if you guys are a Fortnite crew member within Fortnite, keep in mind, if you load up onto Rocket League, even if you don't play it, if you load up onto Rocket League on the same account that's connected to Fortnite, you will get all these rewards you see here on screen. I recently loaded up on my Rocket League. I got myself a bunch of new decals, three new vehicles for completely free just by loading up onto Rocket League. So I definitely recommend doing that if you have not yet already. And if you have, let me know that you got those free cars down below. Now, with that being said, very soon we're gonna be seeing Rave Mellow within Fortnite. And this is basically what Fortnite said on their blog post. And they said, and wait, did Marshmallow combine with the Raven for the monster mashups? When Four Nightmares 2024 nears its end, Rave Mellow will enter the shop. To remind you that Four Nightmares is only the beginning of the end of year party. So there's going to be so many new things coming through that you need to be ready for. Also, the Rave Mellow skin, I will be gifting out to a lucky subscriber. So just make sure you're active to the channel and tune into the daily live streams. And with that being said, Fortnite is working on a new gifting system. It's currently in the works, so be ready. I don't know what this is going to have exactly, but I'll keep you all in the loop, of course. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe if you're excited. And I hope to see you in the next one.